All right, here we are at day number 21 in the studio, and we got all our parts in. We should be able to finish these two floors and get this guy done. So I started on the uh, window panes, and we got to do uh, some of the supports going up. So we're going to get those done. I don't know if I'm going to get done building today. It'll be close. I'm going to try to get both floors done, but it's going to be close. We might have a day 22. But if I can get these two done, it'll complete the skyscraper. So let's get to building here. So if you are curious as to how the supports are built, uh, here it is. Got a one by one plate bottom, our uh, studs on the side. Then we have a three tall one by one brick. Uh, and then we have plate, studs on the side, studs on the side, plate, brick, plate, studs on the side. So there it is. That is... Uh, what runs up there's five per section so we need 20 on each one so I just gotta get them done so day 21 is complete with everything put together the, the top floor is done and this uh, came together really nicely really like how it turned out uh, we're gonna throw uh, a video in here of the restaurant turning so let's get that turned on and let's take a look how that works okay so we got our uh, hub uh, linked up with the Bluetooth and we'll just close that door there to kind of hide it and this is on a speed of 30 uh, if I go any slower faster it just it's wonky so we've come up with 30 there it is and it, it's not terribly fast, but I would like for it to go slower, but the motor just uh, makes it jump. So let's see if we can uh, change it to 20 here. That's 21. So it just, I don't know if you can really see, but it likes to try to jump around. So I don't know, we might try to find 25 or somewhere, a happy medium, but 30 seems to be working the best. And let's see if we can kick it back up to, let's go 28. It was kind of quick, but uh, this ended up being uh, 6,022 pieces. Uh, we are at, let me stop this here. We are at uh, three feet, two inches. I originally wanted to do uh, four feet but uh, the plans just didn't let it happen. Uh, each floor is five inches, so I can add two more floors and get my four feet. That was what the uh, original plan was to have two more floors in here, and that would bring it, let's see if we can get here. So right now we're about to here on the tower for the, uh, for the top terrace, and I wanted to get it to about here. So we might add it later, we'll see. I'd, I'd like to, the, the plans are there, so. Uh, this is all modular. Each section comes off. So this section here, this section here, uh, this is one floor. And then we got these all down here are the same. Uh, we'll add interior to this later. Uh, we'll add interior to our restaurant, our kitchen. Uh, and what we're going to do is each kid uh, here is going to design their own room uh, or floor or something along those lines. And the top floor is uh, mine and my wife's. Uh, we kind of worked on the design for that one. We went to the 1950s. So uh, if you want to check out uh, each day where you want to, you can look back through our videos. But this is the final uh, build for this now. So I think it really turned out nicely. Uh, I don't want to look at the cost of this one. We did have a lot of parts here in an inventory. We got a lot of it started without doing many orders. So didn't spend too much on this. Uh, not too bad, but... Uh, you know, 6,022 uh, pieces. You can uh, use your imagination on how much that costs uh, for U.S. dollars. And, uh, you know, these, <laughs> these, these base plates in here, they're the big ones. They're about $3.50 each, and there's four per floor. So that's, that's going to get uh, pretty quick there uh, on the price. So, uh, but it turned out nicely. Our, you know, our first floor is the dark green light bluish gray with our sand green, our sand green restaurant. And uh, really, 
really turns out nicely. So we're going to move on to our next project and uh, we'll see you guys later.